I'm uh, Touré Daouda. I'm a member of the Ivorian Parliament, Côte d'Ivoire, and I'm, I'm also the chairman of the Committee on uh, Energy, Transport, Industry, Communication, Science and Technology of the Pan-African Parliament here in Midran in South Africa. Today, what I would like to tell you about is my opinion of this parliament, which I believe has a great future. We also have a great president, Mr. Nkori Dang, that is doing his best to put this parliament to the top. And this is a very important instrument for the, uh, 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 for the African Union in the case that we have to understand that this parliament is very useful like the European Parliament, we need to bring this Parliament from a consultative Parliament to a legislative Parliament. Africa has a lot of uh, challenges, and these challenges cannot be made without democracy, without fair election, without transparency. And these are the basic fundamental action to be taken to eradicate poverty, because that's what Africa is about at this time. Africa is a rich continent that needs to eradicate poverty through good governance. And uh, the African Parliament, the Pan-African Parliament, could be a good and important tool for the African people to exercise their human right, the good governance, for the best of the African people. Now, concerning the Parliament, the Pan-African Parliament, I could say this Parliament at this point of time is at its beginning, although we've been here for almost 12 years, but we're improving our type of management. We are improving also in terms of um, uh, human resources, in terms of organization. All I would like to say, the world, the African people have to be patient because we're in the middle of a process and I think that we can succeed. And this success would demand the help and the support of all the African people and especially all the African government because we need to ratify the new protocol that would uh, bring us from, as I said, from a consultative studies to legislative studies.